Many millennia ago, Malekith waged a great war upon Uthawan, forever sundering the elven race into the High Elves and Dark Elves. The elven pantheon is also split between the Kadai, the gods of the heavens, revered by the High Elves, and the Synthari, the gods of the underworld, revered by the Dark Elves. Asurian, the creator, is the king of the Kadai, the oldest and greatest of the gods. He sits upon a diamond throne, observing the world, shaping elven destiny as he sees fit and may take the form of a phoenix when he desires. As Lord of the Kadai, Asurian has the final say in any decision or disagreement between the gods, all others submitting to his judgment. Aisha is a goddess of fertility, nature, and mother of the elven race. Aisha cares for her children deeply and is always ready to aid them in times of need. The Ever Queen of the High Elves is blessed by Aisha with power and wisdom to help guide the elven race. Kurnos is the god of the hunt husband of Aisha and father of the elven race. He is the lord of forests and beasts, watching over hunters and demanding that animals never be killed for sport, only for subsistence. To break this rule is to offend Kurnos and invite disaster, for his vengeance is swift and brutal. Ladriel is the patron of travelers and protector of the hidden and lost. It is said that she is the only goddess to still walk upon the mortal world, guiding the lost away from danger. Lilith is the goddess of dreams and fortune, the patron of seers and prophets. Lilith granted three items of great power to the elves. The star crown, which granted the bearer knowledge from the gods. The amulet of sunfire, which brought hope to those in despair and repelled evil. And the moon staff, an artifact of great magical power. Hoeth is the god of wisdom and knowledge, who gifted the elves with sorcery. He is the patron of mages, scholars, and all those who seek truth and understanding. Loic is a god of laughter and trickery, the patron of dancers and singers. Loic often tricks Selnesh out of claiming elven souls and is constantly hunted by the chaos gods, but the trickster god is cunning and is never caught. Val is a god of smiths, the patron of artisans, and the creator of many great artifacts. When Cain imprisoned Kurnos and Aisha, Val challenged the war god to a duel. The smith god would lose, be crippled and blinded, and enslaved to the will of Cain. Ever since, Val has labored ceaselessly, forging great weapons for the war god in preparation for the end times.